I think first is to take speed. I don't think without that it'll be really possible because speed is as standard as it gets. And even the questions that come in the exam are the way the speed GTS are also set. So I bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of Speed Medical Institute to Dr. Pranay Lomba for scoring a topmost rank of CML 10 and AML of 14 in uh, super speciality of DM Cardiac Anesthesia in EME SS November 2025. Congratulations to you. Thank you, sir. So, great to have you in the session. Can you know a brief background from where you started till date, what all you have done? Uh, sir, I started my journey in 2015. I did my MBBS from Sri Siddhartha Medical College in Tumkur. Then I did my MD Anesthesia from Kasturva Medical College, Manipal. Then I did a few months of SR ship in Dr. B.R. Ambedkar Medical, Medical College in uh, Bangalore. Excellent. Then I got a rank of 198 in uh, NEET SS 2024 last time. Wasn't happy with that. So, I sat and prepared again. Okay, what do you want at that time? So, yeah, I wanted cardiac anesthesia even at that time. <laughs> so, you are not getting it? I was getting it, sir, but I was not getting it at the best you know, university. <laughs> and I wanted okay, to where you wanted. It. You got what you wanted, but you didn't get where you wanted. Yeah, I wanted Jayadeva that time in NEET. So, I wasn't getting that. So, I thought, let me just try again. I want to do it from the best place and not adjust for less. Okay, very nice, very nice. Excellent. Now, uh, can you tell us uh, why DM cardiac anesthesia after anesthesia? Instead of uronesthesia, there are a lot of things are there. Transplant is also there. I mean, why special interest towards this? So, this I developed interest in cardiac anesthesia from my postings. Sir. Like we had, we used to do cases every day for like 30 days. So, that's where I developed interest. And we had a really good staff in cardiac anesthesia as well. And so, he used to teach us every day. And from that's where I developed interest in. Seeing each and every case was different and each and every heart was different. Each and every heart was beating <laughs> differently. And every every case, the surgeon also approached the case a little differently. So that's what made me a little interested. Okay. Very nice. Very nice to know. And uh, what did you do after that to decide to go on DM Cardiac? What was your preparation, preparation strategy? What all you did to achieve this rank today? So, so I initially had taken speed even for last time NEET SS. So I just continued with the same. Subscription. I started my study somewhere at around August, sir. like after I started studying in August. So I just, I think the formula was pretty simple. So I watch every video of Dr. Shruti Ma'am and Dr. Ailan, sir, and take a seat. That's, <laughs> all, that's all it was. And did all the 10 INISS grant tests that I had. I think almost around 15, 20 questions were straight directly out of the GT, even the options were in the same order. Really? Yeah. This out of 80, is, almost 20. Which GT you to us? So the INISS 10 GTs that were there. Okay. In that, any G, particular GT or more or all GTs together? Like I did like all the 10 INISS GT before going for INISS exams. Okay. So from there only almost around 20 questions were directly from the... Oh, it was direct, is it? Yeah, even the options were in the same order. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm very sure. <laughs> okay. No, we never knew it. I am just asking. It's the first yeah. time I'm hearing it. And uh, so it is good because if 20 questions makes a huge lot of difference in 80 questions. Yes. Huh? If yes. 200 questions, okay, 10%. But an 80 question, 20% is very big. Yes. 20 question. Very good. And uh, I mean, hard work of uh, faculty uh, to be yes. appreciated, uh, to bring exactly close to the exam. I really appreciate people with faculty of anesthesia. Yes. I mean, sirs and island sirs video and Shruti Mam's video are like as direct as it can get. And it's very clear. Topics and concepts have been made very clear. So I think just watching that and watching that once and going through the notes was sufficient for me to get. Very nice. Very nice to hear. And uh, excellent. And now, um, can I know uh, from you, uh, how many questions did you attend? Sir, I attempted 74, sir. Okay. Can you tell us something about the paper and also the interview? What were the requirements of the paper? Yeah. On what? And uh, interview, how did you prepare? What happened in the interview? Can you tell us something on that? Yeah. So I think for preparing for the theory exam, I think speed was more than enough. I think just had to go through cardiac, the cardiac anesthesia part I had to go through entirely. Mm -hmm. So I think if you do your cardiac anesthesia videos properly, if you want to go into cardiac anesthesia, then I think the cardiac anesthesia videos are more than sufficient. And I think, and with Shruti Ma'am's video and Island Sir's videos, general anesthesia is getting covered more than sufficient. So I think that much preparation was enough for the theory part. For practicals, sir, uh, like couldn't really prepare anything, but I had just gone through most of the X-rays and ECGs from again Speed app itself. And in the and in the interview, they asked me one ECG, 
one chest x-ray and one drug sir okay so these are the three things okay now uh, what is the message that you want to give to students of future aspirants of dm cardiac anesthesia sir i think first is to take speed because i don't think without that it will be really possible because speed is as standard as it gets and even the questions that come in the exam are the way the speed gts are also set and i think like you've always been telling in almost all videos just go through every video at least once or twice and see all the notes and go through all the gts once before you go for the exam that's all i've done this time great i'm very happy for you and also uh, time to thank and whom all you want to thank that uh, they have helped you to made your career till date can you say that i think first i like to thank myself sir for not adjusting <laughs> for the rank that i got last time and taking a seat where i was getting so i didn't a decision i didn't want to make in haste so i think i'm proud of myself for take this extra 5 months because right. i know i deserve to be in one of the best institutes of india so and then i like to thank my parents for supporting this decision of me not working for the last few months and staying home and giving me that chance to sit and study comfortably is also very important and all my staff from post graduation also have always been supportive of me in doing what i felt like and going for my goals all the time very nice very nice excellent now uh, i'm really happy that uh, you uh, one point i learned today first respect yourself yes thank you yourself because that's very important self respect self build self confidence yes. self recognition self appreciation and small wins to pat on self okay did yes. it and go next time i really look up on to you uh, dr pranay thanks and people should learn this people should learn this not to settle for less and you deserve the best yes you deserve the best i like the entire part of it and once again i wish you all the very best and all the success thank you sir great great and a wonderful career of dm cardiac anesthesia i have a lot of uh, respect for cardiac anesthetist as yes. you know a cardiac surgeon dm yes. cardiac anesthetist to the fullest yes. extent so that he can peacefully work in his field yes. yes yes so that is the kind of respect i have for cardiac anesthetist and even for my for my cardiac anesthetist as well i could see him in you and you in him <laughs> in future and in present okay for that i wish you all the best and all the success one day i wish to work with you thank you so much sir be a pleasure all the best thank you sir